Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh I'm Nurul Hasika binti Muhammad Syahri 101726 Today I would like to go over our team's work for our business model canvas First of all, let me present to you our team members There is Mashita, Nur Tasnim, Nisa Shakira, Nur Fizana, Atika Balkis and Nurul Hasika Welcome to Give Hub. We were your ultimate destination for unforgettable gift. With our curated gift box, you can unwrap joy and share happiness in a simple and convenient way. This is our business model canvas, which are key partners, key activities, key resources, value proposition, customer relationships, channels, customer segments, cost structure, and revenue streams. There are several elements in the business model canvas. First thing first is the key partner. We were working together with the chocolate factory to supply our chocolate stocks, also with Bok Factory, the supplier of sticker products for labeling our brand. Next, Courier Service, which is JNT and DHL, and last is SMO. Key activities Managing and packaging gift involves choosing the right items for the gift to improve the customer's experience and raise the gift perceived well. Marketing includes every strategies and activities that a company does to advertise its goods and service. Printing the AWB and which guide are necessary to improve the overall customer's experience and give a personal touch to the gift, while shipping involves the physical transportation of goods from one location to another. Key resources Physical space refers to the physical location such as an office to carry out business activities. Social media platforms such as Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and our business to promote products and communicate directly with customers. Skilled and disciplined workers can significantly impact the success of the business and a local supplier refers to enable all original sources that provide the necessary raw materials, products, or service to the business. Next, value proposition is the value that our product offers to the customers. First, we offer affordable prices for customers. Our gift box provides great savings. Customers can get a gift box of their choice at a price as low as 5 up to 35 ringgit depending on the type of it. Second, various chocolates. We provide 8 types of chocolate for customers to choose from. Third, the packaging will be delivered safely. We use boxes and bubble wrap to take care of the condition of the pack throughout the distribution process to our customers. Fourth, we provide beautiful decoration of the gift box. Our team will take the time to decorate the gift box beautifully to create a wow experience for the person who will receive the gift. Next is a customer relationship. Customer relationship describes the types of relationship a company establishes with a specific customer segment. The customer relationship we use is long-term relationship with customer by using discount and promotion on our product. Next, we use sentimental and brand attachment through social media to build the trust with the customer. Next is channel. First, we have virtual channels which is to reach out various customers including kids, teenagers and adults. Raise awareness channels by advertising on the Google site. Mouth to mouth channels in hope our customers can spread the word to their loved ones in turn. Last, evaluate after sales channels which is by having the feedback from our customers. We move to the customer segment. Customer segments define the group of people or organization that enterprise want to reach and serve. So our customer segment for this business are students, event planner, corporate client, and wedding organizer. Therefore, there are four major items in our cost structure that we employ in our business. First, consider the cost of the goods being sold. The cost of the boxes, ribbons, shred peppers, chocolates, and wish card is included. The expenses of printing comes next. Uh, our company branding sticker is utilized to patch it on the box. Then, for the client who resides uh, outside of our service region, we mail it to them. The cost of printing uh, the decoration elements to adorn the boxes as requested by the customer. Lastly, marketing and advertising expenses, we pay some of our friends to make videos and snap pictures of the goods uh, we sell so that they may write or review uh, and write about it. The last part is revenue stream. First one, online selling. We sell using social media platforms such as Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, 
WhatsApp, and so on. Second one is online advertisement. We also use social media to make advertisement. The last one is postage fee. Uh, the postage fee is RM7.50 for Semenanjung Malaysia and RM9.50 for Sabah and Sarawak. That's all from us. Thank you.